Hello, it's me, it's Goopy. Welcome to another episode of Persona 4 Golden Blind Let's Play on Hard Difficulty. Oh my god, that's quite the title, isn't it? Uh, we're continuing off finding kanji and getting information out of people. Do you know? Hey, have you seen a girl that looks exactly like me? Oh, great. You see, she's my twin sister, and as soon as she school ends, she wanders off somewhere. That's horrible. I wonder where she is. We're the same, so we should be in the same place. Oh, well, you're that kind of twin, huh? Yukiko? I asked people who knew Kanji-kun's family or their shop, but all I heard were bad rumors. Or people saying he was cute when he was little. That kind of thing. I was told to talk to the last person who saw him, but I'm not sure who that would be. Maybe his mom? I would imagine. Which would be further out this way. Gotta find Kanji. Ooh. Oh, you, Yosuke. Hey, how's it going on your on your end? Well, I asked around the shopping district, but everyone's giving me the cold shoulder. Gah! I'm getting frustrated. Where can I find this hint? This old man. Kanji-kun is the son of the textile shop owner, right? He's such a delinquent. What a shame. His mother's such a nice lady too. That's. Oh, is this is this the mom? Ah, uh, are you here to ask about Kanji too? Sheesh. I wonder where- <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I wonder where he's wandered off to now. He's always like this. You know, there was a small boy who came in asking about him not too long ago. I talked to him too, but I haven't seen him around lately. A boy who talked to Kanji? Could it be the small boy from before? If it was him and he was with Kanji, he might know something. You decide to search for the boy. Okay. <laughs> Um, I don't know where that person hangs out at, though. A oh boy, wear your hat. Hmm, all I can say is I haven't seen anyone like that on the news. Oh, okay, so you what, you only watch the news, you shit? God damn it. I saw a biker gang on the highway a while back. They were racing their motorcycles in the middle of the night. Seeing as I aim to become the motorcycle racing king in Inaba, the glimpse of the wild side they presented was fascinating. Don't you think a man should be dignified even when riding a motorcycle? I'll just say I agree, even though I actually don't. Right? The manly music of exhaust noise is seriously cool. I get that. I, I'm sure a lot of people who, who hate the noise, hate it because they themselves... Well, where am I going with this? I dislike it because of the fact that it's loud and disruptive. But I get why people also like it. I get it, but I don't agree. You. Small boy wearing a hat? Ah, I think maybe I've seen him. He's talking to a bunch of people in Junez. Oh! Okay, shut, shut the hell up. We're going to Junez. Shut the hell up. Straight to Junez. That's all I needed to hear. You're looking for a small boy wearing a hat? Ah, yes, I've seen him. He's been hanging around here lately. He even asked me all the stuff about that incident. He was just over there a little while ago, but maybe he'll be back tomorrow? You decide to return here tomorrow. Okay, so now I just... I just go and do different things then. So we, we just gotta come back here tomorrow, I guess. Let's do the uh, the shopping district and go to the shrine. Wasting my time and shit telling me I gotta wait till tomorrow. Fucking have an ass. Alright, that's alright. We can go see the fox. Nothing's better than going to see the fox. Where he at, though? This is the shrine main building. What will you do? Let's do nothing for a second. Oh god, oh god, how do you play the game? Uh, uh, do I have a hermit persona? Hermit. No hermit. That's okay, we're gonna do it anyway. Wait, can I- Oh, I can't buy personas because I don't have money! Alright, we'll just accept their request. You made sure that there was no one around for- and called for the fox. We're gonna get the- for the- Where are you, my boy? Or girl? The fox brought you an Emma with a wish written on it. This Emma is written in rounded characters. It's probably a young girl's handwriting. I want things to go well with the person I like. It seems the fox wants you to fulfill the wish written on the Emma on its behalf. Could it be thinking that if wishes are fulfilled, the more money will be put into the offertory box? If you fulfill the wish on the Emma, your relationship with the fox may grow stronger. Oh, so this isn't technically based on... The right things to say. It's more of doing the tasks. Okay. Quest 7. I wish for love. 
Yep. The fox seems happy. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Sweet. Um. Wow, I already forgot what the hell. Um, let's check the quest. The girl wishes to have things go well with a boy she likes. That could be anyone. That could be any person. Hmm. Maybe you? <laughs> Just someone right here. I asked God to let me marry the one I love. Are you in love with anybody? A lot of people. <laughs> I am in love. Then you should pray too. Maybe it'll come true. Oh. Oh wait, there's also a boy here. Catching bugs makes me thirsty. I really want some the natural. Want some the natural. But I spent all my allowance. I wonder who it could be. I'm sure it's like a kid at school or something. Well, wait, that didn't even count as an activity for the day. Oh. Oh, I wonder who the kid be. Oh, well, yeah, let's check school, actually. Uh, leave. What a goose chase this has already become. Is it you? What? You're the transfer student, Goopy. G Goopy? Oh, I must have made a mistake. This is your shoebox. The female student ran away. There's something in your shoebox. A love letter? It's a note. Ex excuse me for writing this to you out of the blue. I held my emotions back all this time because I didn't want to disrupt your studies, but I just had to tell you, I love you. It's a very moving love note. However, it's actually addressed to someone else. Apparently the girl put this in the wrong shoebox. Perhaps she is the one who wrote the Emma request from the fox front. Oh my God. Emma requests the fox showed you. You should talk to her the next time you see her. T to the girl that was just here? I, okay. Well then what the fuck do I do? It's a sunny day. Who's this? Teacher, Miss Sofu, Sofue? Oh, perfect timing. Kubi, can I look to you for some assistance? Sure. Ah, uh, that's very kind of you. Allow me to explain. The truth is, I need some materials to build a new dowsing rod? The rod I've been using seems to have been stopped responding to my power. So that's why I thought it might be best to construct a new one, but special objects can only be created from special materials. Do you know anywhere you might be able to find rare raw materials, Goopy? If you do, perhaps I can reward you with something from my artifact collection. I have some very special things you'll never find in stores. Ooh, I, I know a few places possibly. Ah, ha ha ha, then fate guides our hands as history cogs turn. The, the wheel, wheel of fate is, is turning. turning. I'd like you to find me a suspicious pole. If you can, please. Extracurricular activities. All right, lady. Senpai, as one would say. Ohio Gozaimasu. Say, do you like cats? Yeah, yeah. Haha, -ha, good. Then we're allies. Cats are nice, aren't they? They are. They get attached to you pretty quickly if you give them food, though. My store was becoming sort of a cat mansion, no thanks to me. The wife was none too pleased. Okay, you don't look like an adult. I see, so we gotta find that boy, right? Okay, here I go! Okay, a cat! Speaking of cats, meow meow. Meow meow. Alright, cool. Who's this guy? Hey you, are you from around here? Can I ask you something? Sure, why not? Do you know about the Mori Ran Maru? Years ago, I was the manager of Konishi Liquor Store, right here in the, this town's very shopping district. Yeah? But I kind of lost the will to do business and I quit my job as manager. Anyway, to be honest, I shouldn't have come out here to the country, but I can't go back home empty handed, you know? Okay, so you want me to find the item for you? Sure. Uh. Okay. Wow, look at all these fetch quests I'm getting. How exciting. Hey, where's the sports club? Maybe I can just do that. You, what do you want? Hat wearing guy. We're allowed to wear hats in school? I don't think I've seen anyone like that. I've got a little problem. To be honest with you, I think you could hear me out. It better not be something fucking... Thanks. Well, the thing is, my dad... My dad suddenly started making these plastic models. That's concerning. That's fine and all. He could do what he wants, but he got glue all over my desk. Your desk? I can't put anything on my desk anymore. I want to replace it, but I don't have a fitting board. The lumber store in the shopping district closed down, too, so I really don't know what to do. Wow. 
I can count on you. He might get glue on it again, so a thin, cheap one is fine. You're the best. Hmm, weird. <laughs> You're so short. I, I, not that it matters. Uh, you want to join a club? Uh, okay. Sports club. Where do I go to do that? You're trying to break a youthful sweat, are you? You can join either the soccer club or the basketball club. Can I join both? After leaving the faculty office, make a left and go through the exit down the hall to get to where the sports club meets. They're on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Oh, well, I can't do sports. How do people do a sports club today? At least he helped me out. So, uh, uh, wait, this is the faculty, so I take a left. Did he lie to me? I know. Okay, this way, and then I go left. And then. Oh, wait, like out here? Take a tour first. Yes, yeah, so got me high gym. Watch the basketball team. Nice shot. Wait, is this the kid with the hat? Maybe? It doesn't look it actually doesn't look like it. Alright, let's run some basic drills. I don't know what kind of voice to do it. Maybe just uh, just use my regular voice. Yes, yeah, so got me high field. You watch the soccer team. Nice kick! All right, line up. It's time for everyone's favorite sprints. I, uh, yeah, let's check out the basketball club. All right, guys, listen up. You have new teammate. You all know Goopy Legend, right? He's from the city, so I'm sure he's got some moves. He's just waiting to show off. I say this season is in the bag. I'm even thinking about making him captain. What? That's... Wh why are you jumping the gun on this? Sounds good to me. Voting is a big pain anyway. Here, why don't you say something to the team? Nice to meet you. Just go easy on us, okay? They don't seem very enthusiastic. What's going on here? Well, you guys can take it from here. I've got to go check on the soccer team. Goopy, why don't you just watch for it today, all right? I'm taking... I'm taking off now. I'm taking off now. The team practiced a little and left. Bam, bam, bam. Hey. 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 Okay, and now I get it. What'd you think of your first day here? Oh, yeah. I'm Ko Ichijo. Oh, Ko Ichijo. Second year, same as you. Nice to meet you. Good to see someone else take an interest in the team. Oh, I'm beat. Ko, aren't you done yet? Oh. Is this the new guy? <laughs> yeah, can you believe it? He's a transfer stu transfer student. Hmm, that's cool. Daisuke Nagase, nice to meet you. Oh, that's not the voice at all <laughs> that I was portraying. Daisuke Nagase, nice to meet you. Soccer team, second year. Ko and I go way back. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, too far back. I'm getting sick of seeing your face. Oh, banter, friendship banter. <laughs> Did everyone take off early like usual? Yep. I suggested we work on rebounding, but they were all like, that's too tiring. So all we did was take a few shots. Hmm, but I shouldn't scare Goopy with my bitching on his first day. We got a lot of members who don't show up to practice, but basketball's fun. You've played before, right? Oh my god, what am I saying? You've played before, right? Uh... I used to play all the time? Really? Seriously? I can't wait to play you. Play you. Became friends with Ko Koichi Joe of the basketball team and Daisuke Nagase of the soccer team. You feel a fiend bond forming between the three of you. Oh, so I get both of them. Wow. Is it, are they combined? Are they one combined? Two combined to one, Arcana? Wait, let me guess. Uh, duh. I don't know. Strength? Um, damn it. <laughs> Can you tell I'm good at t 
knowing tarot cards? Oh. You have established a fellow athlete's social link. Okay, it is a combined uh, social link. That's cool. You may earn an XP bonus when fusing personas of the Strength Arcana. Cool. Oh yeah, do you know the practice schedule? We meet on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. And here I am on a Wednesday. It's a simple sport, but if you do it right, I'm sure you'll toughen up. Oh, there's no practice on rainy days either, because the other clubs take over the gym. Sometimes it sucks being such a small team. And of course, we don't practice the week before exams. Okay. Are you stuck polishing the balls again? Yeah, while they go to their parties, I get to stay here and play with balls. I love them balls. Man, I want to go party too. Why you gotta say it like that, my dude? I'll help you. Let's get those this done and get out of here. Help out. Be an ass and leave. <laughs> the game's like, don't be an asshole. Help out. Huh? You do that? You're a real pal, man. I think I'm tearing up. Ko is exuberant. Exuberant. That's a fancy word. You decide to go home after helping. See, there we go. There's an activity I could have fucking done to pass the time. God damn. Trying to figure out how to do all this shit. Welcome back! Thank you, Nanako. Um, what social link is Nanako again? Justice! That's great. Oh, and I have a Justice persona. Yeah, let's do it. Are you kidding me? Let's hang out with Nanako. Yes! Nanako looks as if she's not doing anything. I mean, yeah, what is she even watching? Since you have Archangel... Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, spend time with Nanako, uh-huh. Oh, she's so happy! How exciting. Oh, um... Big bro. Yes, Nanako. Nanako is fidgeting. Uh... Go ahead and ask. Yeah! Okay, um, well... Nanako looks relieved. Are you an only child? Uh... That's right. Well... Biologically, I don't know in this game. But realistically, I do have sibling. But for context, would me saying that's right mean that I could be insinuating that she's like a sibling to me? But then if I say nope, I could be relating to her also being an only child, which then creates a bonding of becoming... Sorry, there's too much. <laughs> oh, there we go! See, it's... You're just like me! Oh, but I have you now, so... Oh my god, the process, the, the thinking process, the cogs in my brain are going. They're smoking, but they're going. A while ago, Daddy told me that our family won't get any bigger, but now I have a big brother! That's so true. Nanako beams at you with a smile that covers her entire face. Through that smile, you feel your relationship with has grown deeper. Oh my god, I love this social link. It's just so adorable. She's just so wholesome. How could I not want to protect? Nanako Dojima. So, what does this mean? Besides, stronger justice personas. Let's talk, big bro. Um, I want to hear about your school. Nanako has begged you to talk to her. You decided to talk about various things. Gotta do fucking... Right. Mr. Dojima's fucking responsibilities. Taking care of his child. I gotta do it. I'm happy to. And it's gotten late, so you put Nanako to bed and went to your room. Good. Yo! Yo, Goopy! According to the weather report, we won't have to worry about the fog for a while. Let's keep cool like usual. We can save the day and still keep our skills sharp. That's a good plan. Yeah, it's not going to do anyone any good if we get anxious. Let's be sure to use that time we have until the next foggy day to our advantage so we can save him for sure. Yes. Yes. So true, bestie. Ba -na -ba -ba. Hey everyone! They posted the test results! Oh, the exam! 
the awful moment of truth. Oh well, want to check it out? Well, yeah, of course. Why would I not want to look at my exam? I probably got a hundred on it. No doubt in my mind. Bam, 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 bam. Your score was in the top ten. Wow, nice. Good going, Goopy. You're so smart. Your social link friends seem to be congratulating you. Oh, look at all my, look at the little, little party going on. You feel that you became slightly closer to your school friends. Oh, lunch break is almost over. You decided to return to class. Top 10, huh? You're not going to tell me like specifically where? Just the fact that it was top 10. Oh. Hey, Goopy Coon. We have practice today. You'll be there, right? Uh, depends on if boy with hat is at Juna's. We have to commit? Wait, I don't have to commit. Decide later. I see. I, what do you mean, what will I do after school? I gotta prioritize fighting the kid. Oh my god. Co? Yo, Goopy, you know what? We've got practice day, right? You better be there, man. See you later. Oh my god, I may have made a mistake of joining a bunch of clubs. Maybe you should show up to basketball practice after school. Listen, I gotta prioritize the murder mystery. Can't just be doing an exclusively school life like this. It's the girl that mistakenly put a love letter inside your shoebox. Did you read my letter? I haven't read it. I see, thank goodness. Well, could you just forget about it then? I wrote it anom anonymously, and yet this... Wh what? You don't have anything else to say to me, right? Go away! Did I say the wrong thing? Is she lying? Did I make an oopsie? An oops? Oh, she lied. She's a liar. It totally was to me she lied. Motherfucker. There he is, see? Is there something you need? Many people from the town come and meet here. It's a very convenient location, isn't it? Wasn't this the boy who met with Kanji some time ago? He may know something about Kanji. You're asking if anything seems strange when I spoke to Kanji-kun? Yes. Hmm. Very well. It seems to be an urgent matter, so I'll simply tell you. If you're asking about recent events, then yes, there was something out of the ordinary. It was something I felt when I was with him, so I told him outright that he seemed to be... He seemed to be an odd person? After I said that his expression changed all of a sudden, I was quite surprised. On that basis, I believe his actions were somewhat forced and unnatural throughout the time I was with him. He may have some sort of complex, though I have no proof of this. It seems Kanji has a complex or something of that nature. Kanji's pur purported? purported reaction to the phrase odd person. Maybe this is enough for a clue to Teddy to go on. You should report to Teddy as soon as possible. Uh, yes. Yes. Which we will actually do right now. This is of utmost importance. The fox is here! Whoa, something's here! A, a fox? When did it... The mysterious fox you encountered at the shrine is sitting next to you. Could it have followed you without you noticing? Whoa, where did this guy come from? Okay, I, I'm probably going to be disappointed, but the fox joins us in, in the TV world. I'm going to be ecstatic. Dude, it looks scary, too. No. Oh, this apron. I think I've seen it at the shrine before. God damn it, right where I'm taking a drink. You told everyone about your encounter with the mysterious fox. Huh? Curious with leaves? Huh? Cooperate with us? Are you serious? So it wants money in exchange for fixing us up? Oh, it's so... I love this fox. The fox gave out a cry as if in affirmation. What's with this guy? It acts like it understands what we're talking about. Um, yeah, Yosuke. Get with the fucking program, dude. Yeah. This fox is so cool. It yipped again. Maybe it really does understand what we're Ooh. saying. But when you think about it, that means the police on duty and whatnot didn't find this fox, right? <gasps> if it followed after us, then it really is something. Yeah, that's, that's actually kind of impressive. The fox gave a confident cry. Huh? You think it really understands us? What should we do? Keep it. 
Well, not keep it, but like Well Befriend it. I feel bad if we trapped it. It doesn't look like it'll do us any harm. Yeah, it's our friend. What do you think? Let's let it help. Yeah. And thinking about what happened at the shrine, don't you think this curing would be a big help for us? Yeah. Huh? Are you suggesting we take it into that other world? <gasps> oh my god. Is it gonna- I mean, I, I guess it's not gonna fight with us, but to bring it into the TV with us is gonna be awesome. Hmm. Mm, I guess that might work. It doesn't seem like it's going to leave that easily either. And I definitely don't want it being all sulky and getting up to mischief in the store. Mischief? It's a good fox. The fox looks satisfied. You decide to let the fox do whatever it wants. You should try taking it into the other world. Yes! Let's go, gamers! Oh my god, I'm excited. Um, confirm the situation. Uh, yep, yep. Could be that they aren't involved in the case. Maybe it has something to do with our school, too. You Who knows? Just add up to the pile of things we don't get. Okay. <clears throat> it's what we already know. We'll send it to the TV. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's go. Get us in there, boy. How exciting. Yo, the fox is here! I'm so excited. Sensei, you're here. Any clues? Oh, you found some. Yeah, talk to me. Oh, you found out more about kanji. Yeah. Uh-huh. A complex. Do you want, like, a... Is there a specific complex you need to know? Um... That's it? That's all I have to go on? You're working me to the stuffing. And yeah, get going. Oh, well. Then I'll open my nose up real wide and sniff real hard. That's right. Hmm... Oh, I think I found something. It feels like our target. Is this it? Follow me! Oh, yes. What the hell? Is this a gym? Because it's a locker room? Why is it all, why is the doorway all foggy? It's awfully muggy. Uh-huh. Is it just me, or does the fog here seem kind of different? My glasses are fogging up. Is it like a sauna? My glasses are fogging up. Man, it's hot in here. This place is like a... Come here, pussycat. Um, uh... Oh, such well-defined pecs. What's going on here? There's no need to be scared. I will if you say it like that. I'll scream. Uh. Now just relax. Turn, turn it off. Turn the TV off. What's going on here? Wait a sec. I don't want to go. Hey. <laughs> Let's go back. Run. Is Kanji couldn't really hear Teddy? I mean, where else, right? The nose knows. The nose knows. Yes. We're really going in here? I can already feel the sweat rolling down my back. I mean, That's yeah. Because it's so hot. Is it? A, are we going into like a? Wait. You can't have the whole dungeon be a sauna, right? Maybe. Is that a thing? What is this complex that Kanji has? Kanji's location has been pinpointed. All that's left is to rescue him. You should prepare yourself for the rescue mission. Oh, oh, oh we're here! Oh my god. Ever, uh, folks? Yo, she's 15? She's like a level... She's the highest level? Damn. Konoha Sakuya. Priestess. Oh, she has a really cool persona. Oh, I love it. Uh, healing, fire. So, fire. That's good for our little setup, because we got fire, ice, electricity, or is this wind? Okay, I just want to check real quick, please. Yes, electricity. Or no, wind. Oh, and I'm electricity because of Izanagi. I still have Izanagi, right? Obviously, because I'm going to keep them the whole game. Uh, right? Where... Oh, I gotta check my own personas. Silly. Yeah, I got Izanagi. It might be... Because of this being my first time playing this game, I don't know if I'll be able to level up Izanagi well enough. 
I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Uh, I guess we're good, right? Should we just go? <laughs> I made up my mind, Goopy. We're definitely gonna save him. Remove from party? <laughs> I, why would I remove him from party? We have a full team. Be careful. Oh, we're just, we're just, go we're going straight in, I guess. This is great. This place is really steamy. So why do I feel a chill down my fuzzy spine? I think I caught a cold. My nose is totally useless too. Kanji-kun, where are you? Answer us. Wait, is this a sauna? Or is this a, yeah, this looks like a sauna. It's a sauna dungeon? That's so weird. Oh my God, this music though. Yo, wait. Oh my god, the drums! A shot! Uh, oh! A rare monster! Beat the stuffing out of it! Um, I kind of I looked up this creature specifically. And now I and I forgot how you deal with this. It's like weak to a specific thing, right? Yikes! This is one tough enemy. I know I at least got to get a crit, but in terms of weaknesses, that's kind of what I'm stuck on. Oh no. Maybe Zeo? Okay, resist. One enemy. Fight. No, Fight. don't rush. Oh, I didn't mean there. to So persistent. I gotta change her her battle tactic stuff. I forgot about that. Uh Bufu. Come on! Yeah. Oh, she's got little like Yikes, it's tough. It is tough. Um, so she did fire, which does, doesn't work. I mean... Hmm. Maybe we could try Hama? But I don't... Oh no, I guess I do want to kill it, actually. So we'll stick... We'll, we'll try Hama. Maybe? No. Uh, Degaru. Damn, it missed. Maybe we should try... Wait. Ooh, wait, okay, who's next on the... Probably him? And then... And then I can use a physical attack and then do a crit? Don't run. Okay, cool. Uh, two times. Let's do it. Double fangs, boy! Oh, damn it. Um... Sonic Punch? Persona. Miss? Yeah. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Hmm. What a predicament. Come on. Yeah. Yikes, it's tough. Problina. That was interesting. We'll do double things again, I guess. I gotta get that crit. Miss? Damn. Try Garu again. Someone else's turn. There. Don't miss. What yes. Yukiko. Down. We must strike. We must strike. Ready, oh, it's Yukiko. Right You're my hero. Oh, wasn't it an insta kill? I thought that was like the whole point. Okay, I guess we will. Just keep keep doing Skullcracker. Couldn't quite beat it. It raised its own. Okay, you motherfucker. Oh, you're done. You're done. Wait, do I have? You yeah. Don't no to that. No to that. You can go. Let's go! We finally killed one for once. Shuffle time, hole. Bam, bam! I want the money up. Ah, oh, so much money! So much money! Look at all that money! My the neurons are activated. 
We felt a surge of energy. Congratulations! And I leveled up. You sense that another change in, is about to occur within you. You can now store up to eight personas. Thank God, something inside you also has changed. Archangel. Shit, I should have had easy Nagi on. Now, oh, well, that doesn't matter. Another level for me. Oh my God, yes. Bam bam. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. The stat increases. And Mabufu? Yo, the stat increases. And media? Oh, that's gonna be so nice. Having more than one person with media. Oh my god. What a wait, you know what? We'll end it off here. <laughs> What a way, what a way to, I mean, I know this is a little, like, uh, kind of a tease, but. We're, like, we're, we're going into it. We're, we're doing the dungeon. Oh, it's Steamy Bathhouse. I didn't even read the name at the bottom left. Steamy Bath, it's a bathhouse? It's not a sauna? All right. I guess either way. It's all the same, I guess, in a way. How interesting. Um, okay, well, I. I appreciate you all for stopping by, watching another beautiful episode of Persona 4 Golden, Blind Let's Play, Hard Difficulty, I might add. Um, and I'll and I'll see you all in the next episode. Oh my god, this music is so good!